<gasps> this is awesome. That pizza. So this is the third gaming headset that I'm going to review for a company called Exa and I'm really excited about it. It has a very unique name, Fenrir, which is a, a monster wolf, which is very cool indeed. And it kind of resembles that design. It has this green, mean light staring at you on the both uh, headset and I just love the green color that goes well with the black and so on. So it was very tempting indeed. And uh, one of the unique thing about this is that I don't think as far as I'm concerned, anyone from YouTube has actually reviewed this item. I don't think this is also not available on um, Amazon at the moment as well. So that makes me very unique. So thank you very much Exa for uh, letting me be the head of the curve. So this one actually comes with the USB and a 3.5 millimeter plug. So I'm think I think you've got to plug it both at the same time for better sound quality on both end. And it has a cool LED lights indeed. I just love the design. It's so cool, uh, which is the unique design and fashion looks. And it has a PU with uh, leather ear cushions as well. So it will be comfortable to wear indeed. So very excited to do the unboxing. So here it goes. All I need to do is take this one out. Cool. So along with it, immediately we get this cable sticking out. <laughs> Love that. Oh man, this is going to be so cool. So it doesn't come with the pouch case, which is very unique, but it also comes along with the separate um, earphone option. That's cool. And a tiny um, booklet for the usual manual. So the immediate impression about this headset is that I just love that green mean uh, eye staring at you with the um, green light there. And um, it actually looks like it's speaking to a microphone that it actually ends with the green uh, lining as well. And it actually has three dots for some reason. So I don't know the professional side of this knowledge, but at the same time, we got the Excel logo with the triangle on and it's expandable indeed. The quality is light and really good actually. And there's a carbon fiber on the top trying to tell you that that's why it feels kind of light and also rigid at the same time. So good quality. On the other side, it looks like the original face kind of looks like the Gundam um, expression there and um, soft cushioning. And on the back side, it has the mute uh, microphone button up and down and also the volume up and down as well. Um, and the actual attaching cable, this doesn't actually come off, but the far other end, it w comes with the USB and also the 3.5 millimeter earphone jack. So um, I presume we got to connect both of them, but anyhow, what I'm going to do is connect this to my um, computer and then compare it the sound quality with my Sony XM4 using my bruv here. So here it goes. So now let's do a sound comparison between the XF Fenrir and the Sony XM4 headset.
Okay, so let's see how well this sounds like. So I got three guys here at StarCraft 2 just about to shoot some of the units Base here. So I don't know whether you guys can hear me, but let's hear the gun sound to see how well. Okay, so let's make sure it shoots. So I, this is one of the most harsh tests that I'm going to be carrying out, which is StarCraft Base gun sound while I'm actually speaking. Uh, so I just want to make sure any game has a meets the standard because I think anyone in this circumstances should be able to communicate with their fellow team members and so on. And the gun sound is really loud, Base as you can see. So attack. that's going to be my microphone test here. How's it sound? Good? So the overall impression of this Fenrir gaming headset from EXA, which is technically called E7000, is that not only has a mean monster green uh, light eyes actually staring at you, so you get intimidated by it, but the quality of the plastic is really good. I mean, it's also light because we also can see the carbon fiber topping on the uh, gaming headset. Uh, for the outer appearance, the green, I love the green color that goes well with the black color. And also it goes well with my HP gaming laptop as well. So it's like a good combination here, but also the sound quality. Wow, I mean, it's one of the best gaming headset that I reviewed so far. It has a very strong treble sound and the, the beat sound. Comparing to the Sony XM4, Sony F XM4 feels like everything combined together in a well-balanced wireless. This one, it has a bit more like a surrounding feel, if that makes sense, while the treble and the bass coming at you uh, so that I think it will be better for the use of gaming purpose in these. So it's well-structured, well-designed, um, well-programmed. Uh, gaming headset indeed. So also, um, as you know from the past, I have actually reviewed some other gaming uh, headset and then when it comes to StarCraft gaming uh, performance, when it comes to units actually shooting guns, that's when I tend to test the microphone. And this one definitely is much better than the other uh, game headsets that I reviewed. You can clearly hear my uh, microphone sound and um, you're not going to have any trouble conversation with having conversation with your fellow um, team units when you're actually on a team chat and so on so yes everything makes sense and why do you need a separate battery in fact you're going to play when you play games all you need to do is just plug it in and i think one of the best um, reason for the sound quality and the microphone quality is that it has the usb connection and also the 3.5 millimeter microphone jack so the quality wise sound quality wise the best gaming headset and I'm overall pleased with this. So I'll definitely recommend this um, Fenrir gaming headset by EXA. So please do check it out for yourself, how good it is. But anyhow, if you have any queries or if you have any troubles or anything that you want to find out from me in regards to this gaming headset, please do comment below. And thank you very much for watching this video. This is LJP Tech. All the best. Bye-bye.